guys? It's a very trailer reaction. It's called Cyrano, I guess. That's how you pronounce it. Not 100% sure. Uh, Peter Dinklage. <clears throat> He's in Game of Thrones. That's really the only place I've ever seen him in. You know, and uh, he's a pretty famous actor, too. So, uh, let's check it out. He's here. Cyrano? Oh, Cyrano. Yeah, man. Pleasure to meet you, Cyrano de Bergerac. You're a freak. <laughs> freak. Ooh. Best friend, I'd be very angry with you if you died. Man, take no crap. Good for him, too. My sole purpose on this earth is to love Roxanne. Does she know? The world will never accept someone like me and a tall, beautiful woman. We yeah, have no scrum. money. A clever marriage is your only option. I won't be rescued. I'm not in distress. Love, does that mean nothing to you? Children need love. Adults need money. Oh. I need something to die for. Write poems and cry for, and I won't be ashamed. I'd give anything for someone to say that they can't live without me, and they'll be there forever. I have a confession to make. I am madly in love. Perhaps he feels the same. But I've never actually spoken to him. Of your love? I think. <laughs> He is Christian. Christian Nubelet. He's Ooh. a new recruit in your regiment. Of course he is. A woman like Roxanne wants wit, romance, poetry. I don't know how to speak romantically. I am a poet. My words upon your lips. I will make you romantic. Really, dude? Will you make me handsome? She loves me! I give for someone to I thought he was going to get the woman, but apparently not. Man, Speak to me like you do in your letters. You are a beautiful flower. I am not a flower. I need more. Ooh. You're in love with her. Oh, duh. My fate is to love her from afar. Come on, my man. We must let her decide our fate. She must have the choice. Huh. Hey, you know, I can understand with that within that era. That's probably what maybe seventeen hundreds. You know, little people were you know looked down upon, stuff like that. But I mean, screw them, man. You know, you find a woman you like. You know, you two have something in common. I say go for it. You know, it's all about the confidence. You know, just make sure, you know, you two actually like each other. You know, don't let discrepancies like that, you know, whether you're extremely tall, extremely large, short, or whatever, you know. Hey, if you two got something, go for it, you know. And uh, I'm going to have to put this on the back burner. I know a lot of people are going to hate on that, but I'm not a really big fan of love movies. Sorry. Let alone that have, like, music, stuff like that. Just not my type of movie. Uh, I think the last love-esque movie I ever watched was Titanic. And that was the first Titanic, not the second one or remake or whatever the hell they made. The actual first one. That was actually good. You know, that one I actually highly recommend. You know, that's probably about it. Otherwise, you know, I stick to my horror and thrillers and stuff like that. Sci-fi movies and stuff like that. That's my genre. Uh, looks like it's actually going to be a good movie if people actually, you know, are into love stories and stuff like that. Hey, I say, more power to you. Go ahead and watch it. But it's just not for me. But either way, I'm going to get this trailer reaction out for you guys. And, um, you know, it's Wednesday, so you guys will continue to get more trailer reactions than usual. <laughs> I'm just hoping this weekend goes better. <laughs> but I hope you guys stay safe and healthy. And I'll catch you guys in the next uh, reaction.